everyone, Chris Killinger here and welcome back to the channel. Today's episode of Norlin Axes in under three minutes, we're talking about the camper axe. For all purpose use, this axe is extremely strong and durable. Head two and a half pounds, high carbon forged steel, ground tempered and polished by hand. Handle 24 inches, straight hickory, leather sheath included. I also have another printout where it says the camper this is the camper. There's no other axe like it. Norland's camper axe is the result of a composite of thought, opinions, and suggestions from professional outdoorsmen, guides, outfitters, and woodsmen. The camper has the weight and length to qualify it for rugged utility work and accounts for its distinction with the features listed below. 24 inch pole type straight grain hickory flamed finish. The handle is straight for strength and ease in packing. This handle design has extra strength in it and below the eye of the axe head. It is designed to work the weight of the axe head in proper balance, whether used with two hands or one. Two and a half pound head of the finest tool steel. The extra large eye is to ensure more wood to metal contact, to prevent loose heads and provide extra strength. Bit blades and poles are in strong proportion. The camper is easy to carry or pack as a total weight complete with sheath at three and a half pounds. The camper axe is sometimes tricky to identify in the wild because it's often confused with the Canadian pattern. One of the very distinct features of the camper axe is a sharp turn towards the beard of the bit. This is almost like a Hudson style bay head with a very large pole area versus a traditional Hudson Bay with a very short pole. I suspect that they designed this after a Hudson Bay axe and one of the downfalls of the Hudson Bay Axe is the head tends to loosen because it doesn't have much eye to wood contact up here. Very, uh, very unique axe. It's got a good weight to it too. It does feel good. This one does have the camper script on it and genuine Norlin on the other side. It also would have came with just Norlin. The camper axe was also made from 1967 to 1986. I hope you've enjoyed today's episode of Norland Axes in three minutes or less. And I hope you'll tune in the next time when we talk about the saddle cruiser. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's video and you'll click on that subscribe button so you won't miss out on future videos. And thanks for clicking that thumbs up. We'll see you guys in the next video.